Hey, this is Dylan with Matthews Pest Control. Uh, today we got called out to do a job and um, client was thinking she had some bees or hornets and come to find out we came out and located in this area there was an entry point and there, I noticed that there were yellow jackets going in and out of the hole. And they, the hole was only about the size of maybe a, a nickel or, or a quarter and they were coming in and out and um, I probably noticed about 50 to 100 of them coming in and out when I first got here. Went and got the spray rig and walked back here and was getting ready to hose it down. You gotta be careful with yellow jackets. They are aggressive. They're more aggressive than bees and wasp. And they, um, when you start getting around their nest entry point, they will start swarming and coming towards you. So I basically got my spray gun with a, it had a pyrethroid uh, active ingredient in it and pretty much just flooded the hole and they started swarming out. Just kept flooding the, the entry point, so, soaking in that soil and getting it down into wherever their nest was. And after probably about 20 minutes, the activity slowed down and I was able to come over here and we were able to dig this nest up. Uh, one thing to think about with yellow jackets is they could be out anywhere in your yard and unless you could be, mow, you know, you could be mowing your yard, uh, you could be cleaning up pine straw like in this instance. I just remember saying they were cleaning up the pine straw and the yellow jacket started swarming and they got stung. Um, they're not very visible unless you just happen to see them and when you see them, you need to act quick before they do get a nest. This nest <clears throat> was about 12 inches wide, 12 inches long ways, went to the soil about 8 inches. And they have tons of little eggs in here that are gonna would, would have eventually turned into adult yellow jackets. Um, so just think about when you're outside with the kids or playing with the family, mowing the yard, cleaning up anything, that you're keeping an eye out for them because if you do get stung by them, they can become deadly. Uh, they do they will bite onto the skin and then they use that bite to inject their stinger further into the skin. And depending on um, how you how you react, they can become deadly. If you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out to us and thanks. I hope you're having a great day.